all right everybody we are doing a water change on my angelfish tank right now and i wasn't going to make a big deal out of it or video it or anything but i've stumbled across something unusual in my filter so we're going to stop for a moment and have a look at it the first thing i noticed when i started pulling these trays out was this if you're familiar with these um sun sun filters where the uv light goes down there's actually a plastic shield that sits here with a spiral in the middle and that causes the water to swirl around the uh, uv sterilizing light the other thing i noticed when i started pulling it apart was i saw this blue stuff floating in the water so i'm not sure what's going on but when i got to this tray again i'm missing the inside is just gone it's been like chewed away and i can see some of the filter material has been pulled down through it. But the thing that really got me scratching my head, let's see if I can set this down here one handed. When I picked up my sponge for my sponge filter, look at this. It's just disintegrated. Now, the only thing I know that'll break down plastic like that is UV radiation. Look, you can see more of it over here. This is the piece that just fell off. But look, you can see the edge of the screen. Again, just crumbling away. So the only thing I can think of is that somehow, I don't know why, but the plastic ring in here, and here's part of it, this is supposed to be a solid piece of plastic that creates a channel for the water to flow through and shield the inside of my filter box here. If we look at the next section, see what we're looking at when we pull this one out. If we look at this next section here, this one actually has, I'm gonna try to do this without knocking everything over. I don't wanna drip all over the place. Okay, see that's intact. That's the way it's supposed to look. And you see how it's got the sort of corkscrew causes the water to swirl around. That's what the inside of one of these filters is supposed to look like, or one of these trays, rather. Why my... I mean, the stuff just falls right through now. So I'm going to have to put it back together using this tray, because I don't have a choice. But I think I'm going to have to go on the old interwebs and see if I can't order me a couple of replacement trays and also figure out why the trays were doing that. All right, see, this one's intact as well. So I'm not sure what it is. I've looked, and the only thing that goes down in there is the glass tube with the um, UV light in it. I thought maybe the way it was worn out like that, it almost looks like it had been worn down. I was thinking maybe a, an impeller or a component within the filter itself was spinning and wearing the plastic away, but that doesn't seem to be the case. I'm not really sure what is going on in there perhaps sand was being kicked up and as the sand went through there it slowly grounded down I don't know that's a bit of a mystery but whenever I find something interesting or unusual or different I always like to get it on video because that's a new one on me I've never seen that before and I'm not quite sure what to make of it I'm not sure the implications of all of that broken down material was going back into my tank maybe I don't know again it's you know it's inert I'm sure it's not gonna hurt my tank but it was just something to cause me a little bit of curiosity. The bottom section seemed to be fine. So I'm just going to get back into the, you know, finishing up with the filter and doing the water change. And I guess we can make that, you know, make of that whatever we want. I'm just going to chalk it up to experience. It's something new that I've seen. And now you have seen it with me. So I'm not going to do any more of this water change on this video. I'm just going to thank you for watching this one and hope you enjoyed it. Hope that was a little bit uh, informative or at least maybe, you know, opened up your experience to fish keeping a little more. Because, again, that was a new one on me. Never seen that before. So thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you real soon on the next one.